50% off today. Watch this video, see what else is in the bag. Hey everyone, thanks for stopping in. Welcome to another Thrift Union video. My name is Kevin. Uh, today we're going to go over a bit of a thrift haul that we uh, picked up some items when we went to Tilly's. It was 50% off. Uh, women's jeans and men's short sleeve tops. So what we got first, we're going to go over the jeans. Um, and all these, once again, were half price. And you're going to see, without 50% off sales um, at most of our thrift stores here, um, a lot of things are you just can't make too much money on it the profit margin would be really slim uh, so first up we got some buffalo women's uh, jeans get the light on there it's buffalo get the tag quickly here for you see that buffalo get some light in there Um, so these are size 28 to these um, actually this is one of the more reasonably priced ones so $7.99 so $8 and we got it for half price so four bucks and these will go anywhere from uh, $25 or so next another pair of buffalo Paid, uh, well, these were, again, you're going to see here, $12.99, which is crazy for a pair of jeans. Um, so we paid half price, uh, so $6.50. Got a pair of True Religion. religion at this thrift store 14.99 15 bucks yikes uh, so we paid uh, 750 per silver $9.99 so we paid five dollars Uh, so Buffalo and Silver, um, some of the top selling brands for us anyway. We got a pair of Mavi. These were $12.99, so 13 bucks. So we paid $6.50. Uh, and if you notice this here, a little clothespin, this is what we use to um, track or organize our gene inventory um, so it has the location and the item number and uh, which corresponds with a shelf that we got over there another pair of guest jeans to these 15 bucks 750. Oh, these ones are pretty cool. I haven't seen lace up style before. Um, should get uh, mid 30s for these pair. Um, with the Mavis, um, it'll be $25 or so. Um, True Religion will aim to get about 40. Um, they don't sell as well as they used to. Um, so 40 bucks is generally what we get for a pair of True Religions. Again, it, it's going to vary on the model and the style as well, but. Uh, for your standard run-of-the-mill um, for any of the brands we usually will get minimum $25 high-end for a pair of jeans you can anywhere 60 to 70 so we got a pair of Harley Davidson jeans Everyone knows what the Harley logo is these ones actually weren't too bad $7.99 Eight bucks we paid four. Another pair of guests. Twenty-five 
$12.99, so we paid $6.50. As you can see, without 50% off sales, um, especially at Tlees and, um, sorry, what's the other one? Tlees and Salvation Army. Uh, those are the ones that don't have flat prices for their clothes. Uh, for us, uh, Goodwill will have flat price. I believe jeans is anywhere from, I think it's $8, maybe $9. Um, and then also a Teen Challenge thrift store. Um, they do flat pricing. I believe it's nine dollars for the jeans. As well. um, so this was another pair of guests. And this was fourteen ninety nine. So this, uh, this again, uh, low thirties. The pair of guest jeans. Uh, so that's it for the jeans. Uh, so we're going to jump into the men's tops now. Okay, uh, so first we got a Nike polo. Uh, Chelsea, I believe it's Chelsea. I could be wrong. Um, if anyone wants to confirm that down in the comments, that would be great. But I'm pretty sure this is uh, a Chelsea logo. Oh, and that one costs. In their store anyway, $9.99, so we pay five bucks. Um, we got new with tags. Greg Norman, never would have picked up Greg Norman other than the fact it is new with tags and being in the fourth quarter. Um, another crazy price, $14.99. Nice golf polo. Uh, it does have an embroidered logo here. Um, so we paid uh, $7.50 for that, and we should get uh, $25 or so. We got a couple of these uh, Volvo branded polos. It's got the logo on the sleeves and the spell out on the sides there. We got a black one and a blue one. So we'll lot these up. Again, we'll probably get about um, $25 or so. Uh, so regular price on these was uh, $6.90 or $5.99, excuse me. Uh, so these were three bucks a piece. So paid $6 for those combined. So we got FootJoy. Uh, FootJoy is a really good golf brand. That's what their uh, logo looks like. We paid so as you can see, polos are ridiculously priced here, $12.99. So $13, so we paid $6.50. Um, with FootJoy, it is a good brand, but we generally only pick it up if they do have the logo on display on the outside of the clo clothing somewhere. So as you can see, it is there. Uh, if there's no logo on the front or back, uh, we would generally pass. We got standard Tommy Bahama polo. Um, and just notice this little hole in it. Not sure if you can pick that up on the camera. Um, so I'm not sure if we'll list this or not. Um, uh, we could and just indicate that in the ad. Um, however, um, as you can see, it wasn't too bad, but not the greatest, $6. So we paid three. So normally, uh, Tommy Bahama, um, again, the only reason we picked it up is because it had the logo on the front. Um, generally, again, Tommy Bahama, even though it is a pretty decent brand, um, without the logo, um, we would have passed on it as well. And had we noticed the hole, would have passed. Definitely. Uh, so, pretty cool one here. I'm sure everyone recognizes this. Google Polo. And wasn't too bad here. Got here six ninety nine. Um, so I'll probably get uh, twenty five dollars or so for that. Oakley, another decent brand, quarter zip polo. And you're gonna see the awesome pricing with Tlees, twelve ninety nine. And we'll get uh, twenty five dollars or so for this one as well. Got a vintage Tommy polo. 
Um, really, we only picked this one up because of the price. It's pretty generic. It does have the small box logo on the chest there. Uh, has the box logo tag in the side. And so this was half price. So regular price on this was $6.99. Um, so we paid four bucks and generally um, pretty generic Tommy uh, will get uh, 20 25 dollars for that And if you've got any Jays fans out there we picked this up just a Nike Dry fit polo shirt Let me get this tag to focus for you so $9.99 was the price on this one, so five bucks. And again, uh, mid-twenties for that. Another new with tags. Under Armour, uh, this is Toronto Maple Leafs. Um, has a father's trip um, logo on there. Not 100% sure if this was literally from their father's trip in 2017. I'm assuming it would be because I'm not too sure why you would <laughs> want to purchase this if you weren't part of it. Um, but it is new with tags. Um, again, see crazy price on Polo. $17.99 regular price. Um, not sure what they're thinking. Um, so $18, so we did pay up for this one as well. Half price on the 18, so we paid uh, nine bucks. It is Under Armour, new with tags. Um, regular price, um, $64.99. Um, so we'll probably get uh, about $30 or so for this, or may keep it, who knows. So we got an Adidas golf shirt here, quarter zip. Uh, it does have a embroidered logo on the front. Club Link Academy, shouldn't hurt the value too much. Um, it was $6.99, $7, so we paid $3.50 for that, and we'll ask, um, uh, pardon me, uh, mid-twenties, uh, $25 or so. Again, got another foot joy. Uh, this one was new with tags. Once again, it's got the logo on the back. So. New with tags, Foot Joy at Talese would cost you 20 bucks. Uh, so we paid 10 for this. Regular uh, retail asking was uh, $86. Um, so we'll put it up for about 40. I'm sure we'll get that without any problem, especially with it being fourth quarter and Christmas coming up. That's right, Christmas. I guess we should get by Halloween before we uh, start talking about Christmas. Uh, next we got an Adidas football or soccer jersey, depending on the part of the country you're in or part of the world, excuse me. Well, $6.99 is what they were asking. Oops. So Adidas, it's vintage, could be wrong, not sure actually. Um, so that's the tag. Um, soccer jerseys generally do pretty well for us. Um, got a couple snags on there, some pelling, but uh, got that machine that'll take that right out, no problem. Um, we'll probably get uh, $25, $30 for that. Next, new with tags, Rawlings, Boston Red Sox Polo. So, asking 10, so we paid five. And it's new with tags. Uh, should should be pretty good, I believe they're in the World Series. Uh, so probably get uh, $30 or so for this one. And finally, we have a Roots England Polo. Good brand here in Canada. Been around for a while. Roots Polo. was $9.99, so 10 bucks. And we'll uh, ask uh, $25.30, um, probably come in around there as well. Um, so that about does it for the 50% off haul from Talese. 
Um, as you can see, some of the prices uh, on a regular, uh, without the sale, they're pretty ridiculous, especially on the polos. Um, $20 for an underarm, Under Armour uh, polo, excuse me. Uh, a bit much, especially at a thrift store. I mean, it is new with tags, but still. Um, but I guess they do have to pay their bills as well. Um, so that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, of course, please give us a like, thumbs up, and hit that subscribe button, and also the notification bell if you do want to be notified once we have some more content up there. Um, so that's it for now. Thanks for stopping in. Take care. Have a good one.